Hey guys, hey Aaron Ederson, welcome back to my channel where we react to music but always do it honestly and today we're gonna be checking out a live performance from Osaka and the song is called An Pan Man. Where is it? Okay, uh, I'm looking at the Korean Korean spelling Ang Pan Man. Yeah, okay. I gotta say that I haven't heard the song before so it's gonna be my first time listening to it and yeah it's a live performance and usually I prefer to listen to studio recordings first but as far as I know there's no proper music video for this song so I decided to do it anyways because I know that this channel always uploads high quality uh, fan cams and I forgot to mention that this fan cam is V focus but I'm gonna try to pay attention to all of the members okay now without wasting any more time let's jump into the video before we do that of course make sure you check me out on Instagram and if you want to see my exclusive videos my reactions to live performances such as Mnet performances go to my patreon they're gonna be over there <laughs> See, what are you doing Okay, yeah, I remember hearing the bits from the song in various compilations of BTS, I don't know, funny moments, caring moments, but I only heard that very, very beginning. So, okay, interesting. I actually expected the song to be a little more chilled out, but it's pretty energetic. J-Hope's opening, nice. And V decided that he's gonna dance just with his arms, you know, he decided to rest a little bit. And hey, is that Jin with the camera? Yo, the, the vlogger Jin, the videographer Jin, nice, nice. Yeah, I remember from watching prologue Jin was filming as well. He was trying to uh, c Capture everything so they have good memories to look back to and an inflatable castle on the stage Honestly, I haven't seen it before so I'm, I'm wondering if they're actually gonna interact with it in in some way Look at him Okay, V doesn't want to do anything in this performance. We got it, we got it. He just wants to lay down and rest. And hey, look at Jin in this shot. He's got this look on his face. He put down the camera and he's like, oh, I'm just gonna leave it over here. I don't know if it's still filming and he just decided to put it down to film V while he's laying down or something. But yeah, it's pretty funny. Look at RM, he he looks like he purposely started dancing in front of V blocking the camera so he couldn't see him. And Jin is still filming of course. Y you know, uh, I'm getting this feeling from the song and from this performance that it's not that serious of a song, you know? It's a fun song. They, they don't seem to have a difficult choreography for it. They're just walking around the stage, hanging out, having fun, laying down on these inflatable things. But yeah, you know, I like it, I like it. I like when artists make the performances look very casual, very relaxed, you know, there's nothing, li like it's no big deal, you know, like it's nothing special. Because the fans still enjoy it, and I'm pretty sure if a singer has a stage fright or just stage nervousness, these kind of performances can help them get more used to and more accustomed to performing on the stage like that. <laughs> Look at them, just look at them. Oh, 
okay, this bit was pretty funny. Here you can see RM, he's going like, okay, okay, V, come here, come here, buddy. And then he was like, okay, take my hand, we're going for it, we're going for it. And hey, RM was singing while he was sliding down. So it, does that count as a special skill? Like their voices are stable, not only while they're dancing, but while they're sliding the inflatable castles like this? <laughs> Is that Jen? Yep, yep. Oh, do you hear Jimin in the background? Hey, you know what? For some reason, V doesn't look as energetic, as charismatic, as fierce as he usually does. You see, while everyone's pretty much running around the stage, Jin is jumping right there. He he's slouching a little bit. He doesn't move that much. So perhaps he was tired or I know sometimes they have to perform while they're not feeling that well, while they're sick, for example. So th that might be the case. Or maybe he was just preserving his energy for the upcoming songs. Maybe this one came before mic drop and he was like, okay, I'm gonna chill out on this one. And then when the mic drop begins, I'm gonna give it all I've got. But me personally, you know, if I was in the audience, if I was there, if I actually paid for the ticket, I would still prefer to not see a member if he's like feeling really bad. I, I would still be okay with it. For me, the priority would be uh, for that person to, you know, recover as soon as, as he can. Actually, there's a really nice channel about K-pop, K-pop news called K-pop Junkie, and he's got the same stance on it, so I completely agree with him. <laughs> there we go that's that's v we all know and love i think it's so cool how he got so close to the camera and started literally singing to it into it unfortunately we couldn't see the picture from the camera but i'm sure the fans enjoyed it and the camera operator he was like oh okay we're getting some action here let me let me concentrate on this <laughs> hey, look at what Jimin's wearing. He's got this little heart right here. And I have a similar t-shirt, but it's got a rose, a red rose instead of heart. And I'm noticing the other guys have this heart as well. V... Jungkook. Yeah, it, it seems like everyone's got this little heart right here. What is it? Is it their merch or it's just a clothing brand that uses this little heart as a symbol or something like that? <laughs> and and look at this kiss from V. Damn, wh why are we not getting the picture from that camera? It must have been so awesome. Well, I guess the answer is simple. If you want to experience the performance to the fullest, you actually got to go to the concert. <laughs> Yo, I'm definitely going to go, guys. Like, one day I'm going to go. I know their world tour is finished, pretty much finished by this point. So the next time they tour, I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> and again, look who's getting all the awesome shots. That camera, that camera. Damn, the audience is so lucky, I can't. All right, guys, what can I say? I like this performance, the song itself. I, I can't really say much about it. it, just like this performance, you know, it was fun, it was chill. I wouldn't say I liked it that much, but I definitely enjoyed seeing the guys fool around the stage, having fun, because it's awesome to see them 
perform without really exhausting themselves. With that said, guys, thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, then you know what to do now. You leave a like, you subscribe, and you click the bell. I will see you all, Aaron Aders, in my next video. And as always, take care, keep listening to great music, and love. You can stop.